All right, today we're going to be doing a unboxing uh, and review. I'm going to split it up into two parts, but uh, the first the first part is the unboxing of the Blue Studio 6.0 HD. It's a phone by uh, Blue, which is a company uh, that's based in Miami, Florida. It was Korea. Uh, you know, the company was founded in, in 2009, and the goal has kind of been to uh, produce some low end. Uh, but quality phones here in America, so that's that's kind of neat. Uh, those of you who have kind of seen any of my previous videos, you know, hey, I'm a pretty much Samsung guy. Samsung Note, the S4, the S5. You know, my my uh, current phone is a is a Note 4. So um, to all of a sudden be able to kind of do a, a a lower end, less expensive phone is 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 kind of neat. And I've actually heard really 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 good things about this. The other phones. Um, or the other reviews that I've seen of this particular phone for the Studio 6.0, I believe they were for a different model number. This particular model number, and I'll, let me see if you can see it here, but this particular model number is the D651U. There is a D650, and that one has four gigs of RAM, um, you know, same size screen, same dimensions, everything else like that. This particular one, uh, the 651, that they do sell at Walmart, as a matter of fact. They sell it at Walmart for, our, I believe, $149. Uh, this one has 8 gigs of RAM, which well, it doesn't sound like a huge bit of difference, but I, it really is. So let's uh, get to the unboxing, see what we have here. Just got this in the mail today, so I'm kind of uh, excited about it. Um, you know, nice box, you know, boxes are boxes. No reason to get all excited about that but uh so when we open it up what we have is our phone uh the phone itself in all honesty i did kind of open open up a previous one so i am somewhat fam familiar with it uh but you know if you look at the specs on the phone let me take it out of this plastic here so if you look at the specs on the phone six inch uh, hd display one gig of ram uh, it is 4G. It does have KitKat, you know, Android KitKat on it. 8.0 megapixel on the front or on the back. 2.0 megapixel on the front, and it is a quad-core processor. Uh, 1.3 gigahertz processor, which is kind of a little bit slower. You know, those of you familiar with maybe like the Note 3, the Note 3 I believe had like a 1.5 gigahertz processor. So, uh, but this is a little bit bigger than the Notes. The Notes are 5.5 inches. This is six. So pretty big big screen I'm gonna set this aside just for a second this particular one is in white It comes in uh, two colors one is white obviously one is black um, you know back front is basically the same on both but let's look and see what this uh, what else is in the box so I'm gonna set this aside and if we open up the box here now one of the things that I really kinda like about this and it's 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 a small thing, but uh, I think it's it's kind of neat. One uh, blue does give you kind of some things that ordinarily you would have to buy. So it does come with a screen protector. Uh, normally, anytime I bought a phone, the first thing I would do is run to the mall and maybe get like a you, you know a screen protector or or you know ghost protected or something like that. But it does come with like a screen protector, which is you know that's kind of nice. Um, Sync cord, yeah. All right, looks like okay quality. Adapter. Headphones, which is kind of unusual. You know, they kind of stopped including headphones. Usually, they want you to buy these things. So and then we have instructions, which instructions are also that's kind of odd as far as nowadays. And warranty card. They also give you, believe it or not, a little gel. Uh, protector for your phone and again you, you know these are kind of inexpensive accessories that we probably all bought at some time so it's not like you're saving a ton of money but just the fact that they kind of included it in the package does kind of you know tell me a little bit about about the company that you know they're not trying to nickel and dime you to death uh, to get back to the phone uh, what I ended up paying for the for the phone is uh, this particular one I bought off of eBay it was 149 on eBay had a little 10% uh, or a $10 certificate as far as uh, off, so I ended up paying $139 for it. 
at Walmart, it is selling currently for $149. Uh, and that's on their Walmart website. So if you go to the uh, Walmart website, click on Unlocked Phones. Uh, this is the one that really should be showing up first. So that is kind of neat. Let me go ahead and, and just kind of power it up and give you an idea. The particular phone, honestly, it feels solid. Um, it feels just as solid as, as, as any, any phone out there. It kind of feels like, like, a, uh, like a note or uh, something like that. It doesn't feel cheesy. The screen feels like it's glass and the back is solid. Uh, this particular one also does have dual SIMs. You know, uh, dual SIMs have been out for like a while and I was really never all that impressed with them. It's like, well, you know, they always came on like knockoff Chinese phones or something like that. But I can see how, you know, dual SIM here uh, can actually benefit you. So, we have a SIM card slot one, SIM card slot two, uh, memory expansion for your SD card, and you have a 3000 uh, milliamp battery, but it's not removable. It's actually built in, it's a built in battery. So um, what I'm going to do is part two of this video is going to be uh, going into the details of the phone. I'm going to use it for about a week and I'll come back and I'll give you an idea of you know, sound quality, um, how the internet works, video quality, and just overall durability. So that's pretty much it for this unboxing. I hope it was uh, some benefit to you. Please uh, click on the like, it's down there, and sub subscribe and watch uh, part two, which is going to be kind of a full uh, review of the phone. Um, again, if you're, you are kind of interested in kind of looking at it or whatever the case may be, uh, it is on the Walmart website, and you can also find it on eBay. Thank you.